Hi, welcome to Cook Like a Thai channel. Today I have a very delicious recipe to share with you guys again. Let's get started. We're gonna start with the carrot, yellow onion, garlic, Thai celery stem. If you don't have, you can use normal celery stem, chicken leg, uh, Thai chili paste. I use Mepranom. If you cannot find a Mepranom brand, you can use another brand. Lemon, Nudan. You can use any Nudan you like. Thai celery. I use Thai celery because I didn't have uh, coriander. If you have coriander, then use coriander. Egg, salt, soy sauce. Fish sauce, chicken seasoning. I use Brody brand, and but you can use any kind of brand you like. But I prefer to use Brody brand. It's tasty. Chili powder, sugar, peanut, bean sprout. That's it. All the ingredients we gonna use for today. If you guys ready, so let's get started. And then mint pork and shrimp. You can use how much uh, mint pork you like. It depends how much meat you want to eat. The same with the shrimp. It depends how much you want to eat. So you can add how much you like to. Start with making the broth. I use 3 liters water. Half teaspoon salt. One tablespoon uh, chicken seasoning. And then add the carrot. You can put how much carrot you like. Yellow onion. Garlic. I use five, six pieces of garlic. And then you want to wait to the board to the water boiling before you add in the chicken. Two teaspoon soy sauce. So when the water getting boiled, then add the chicken. the mint pots inside the mixer then add one egg
you want the main pork to look like this so it is the tender and soft see and now we gonna cook the mint pork that we mixed before uh, we gonna use the water from the the the, the broth <coughs> the broth water and then put the broth water into the pot put the pork into the broth the reason we don't put the mint pork into the the broth here because this mint pork gonna use for the we gonna make with the sauce after we can, I, I i will show you how we gonna do that and then stir you want very small piece you want it in a small piece you don't want it in big piece this one i use I used three full head of garlic and now we're gonna pound it to the small piece everything um, in Thailand we don't take off the shell we're gonna, we gonna fry this with the oil and make the garlic oil when you pound it so you want to cover with one hand like this so the garlic didn't jump out because we pound a lot of garlic Smell very good. The aroma is amazing. You should have your own smell. So when you get a small piece like this, then it's okay. We can fry this with a lot of oil. So put a lot of oil. Not like too much, too much, but is it enough like this? Put in all the garlic that you already powered. Smell very good here. So keep on stir the garlic until the garlic get the uh, golden brown. This is smell very good. The garlic look nice and uh, golden brown now. Now it's ready. So we can turn off the gas. And we can leave this for a while. We'll get cold. Then pound the peanut. Or if you have mixer, you can use mixer. It's easier. Now we're gonna start make our noodle soup, our tom yum noodle soup. Here is the secret to make the tom yum noodle soup. Chili paste, Thai chili paste. This chili paste is not spicy, it's uh, like chili paste oil. It's a little bit sweet, In uh, it tastes a little bit sweet, so you're not afraid that it's gonna be spicy. It's just to, to bring up the color and the taste. 
so one one uh, one full you see one full teaspoon chili paste chili powder if you eat spicy or you like spicy so add how much you want I'm gonna add two um, two teaspoon chili powder peanut two tablespoon the garlic oil I love the smell from the garlic, so I'm gonna use like two tablespoons. It brings so much more taste. Fish sauce. Two tablespoons. Half tablespoon sugar. Lemon, if you like sour, you put more lemon. It depends how much Lemon, do you like? How much sour do you like? Oh, it depends how much uh, sour you like. So put as much as you like sour. But tom yum is supposed to be sour, spicy, and then come after salty. So I put like two slice uh, and half. And mean pork, put as much as you like to. And now you want to mix. Make the mean pork to a very, very small piece like this. Smells so good already. Now the color become brown orange like a uh, tom yum. This is gonna be very very tasty. I like my mint pork to be a very very small piece. So we're gonna make this with the soup. And then put the uh, coriander. And now it's time for the next step. I cook my broth like one and a half hour. I want them to taste uh, very, very tasty. So as long as you cook the broth uh, slowly, then it's much taste. You can see from the oil on top like this. This is going to be very much taste. So now is the secret for the, the tom yum noodle. You want to put the soup into the sauce that we mixed before. See the color? And then you want to mix everything together. So you want to pour all the sauce that we mix pour into the noodle. So look at our tom yum noodle. It looks so good. Look at the colors. So delicious. We haven't finished. So we gonna put all the meat and shrimp on top. The pork that you fixed before. Two pieces of pork.
now we're gonna try our delicious Tom Yam Nuta. Mmm, so good. Everything I want, spicy. First it comes spicy and sour, and then come uh, salty after that what I really want. So good. Mm. So creamy, very creamy. Aroy ma, aroy ma. Now we cannot eat the uh, noodle. Mmm, noodle is so good. It's very crunchy from the the nut. So now we cannot eat the soup. Look at the soup. If you love sour spicy tom yam, then this is the perfect version. Mmm. I'm in heaven. <laughs> and now you want to eat with the um, egg. Oh, this is so good. Look at this. Egg, nut, and mean pork, and creamy tom yam soup. So good. Mmm. It's no good. <laughs> this is all for me. <laughs> it's so good, so I forget to ending the video. So my boyfriend has to ask me, you're not gonna say goodbye? Yeah. I hope you like this recipe. And please subscribe to my channel. And write me the comment. I will be happy to read your comment. And what food do you like me to cook next just let me know if you like it share with your friend and family so before i go stay hungry stay safe and stay happy i will see you on next video bye bye